10 pounds, right here. Man. And then they talking about, where are they, 18, 18 wheelers driving themselves. What y'all I'm saying? Y'all gonna get behind that wheel? The people, come on, bro. Oh, she finally ain't on the phone. Damn. Damn. <laughs> Let me see what you got. Let me see what you got. Let's see. <laughs> I told y'all, you got that ball for nothing. I'm on here like I'm live. I'm, you know, yeah, you know, we live, all that, yeah, yeah, yeah. We, man, out here with my people, man. That's how we do it. That's how we do it. That's how we do it. Hey, man, you don't lie, bro. Man, why? I'm saying, though, why you got that ball in your hand? You ain't got no skill. You know what I'm hey. Look, crossover game. Ooh, straight up. Don't make me come out of retirement. Don't make me. Come on, man. I'm just saying, y'all over here talking about the, the electric cars and... Man, what's I, in that cup? What's in that cup? Shit. You know, you know what's in my Sweet cup. Tea. You know what's Sweet in here. Yeah. I'll tell you what, though. Look at me all joking side, though. If I ever decide to close my eyes... You might go to sleep. No, if I die. Like, if, if I just... No, no, no. Real talk. Real talk. Real talk. I'm, I'm about to go Real talk. No, listen, listen, listen. If I ever... Decide to close these eyes. I'm gonna tell y'all like this here. Got a dollar and some change. I had a time to make a change. Probably still sleep. I don't know how you sleep all day. I mean, when the sun come up, I'm up. Let's get a nose behind sketch. You're going to miss out on something. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you sleep, you're going to get scooped, you know. <laughs> this coming from the little girl who was a contributor for the Pinecrest Times and did two or three of them. Now, all of a sudden, she a journalist. <laughs> well, this contributor got front page. Front page? Online. And? It's a computer. The computer ain't got no pages. It ain't a book. <laughs> Oh, it's literally called a landing page? What? Nothing. That's stupid. <laughs> Y'all are like a married couple. Couple, hold on. Hello? Yeah, yeah, this is he. Oh, wait. Wait, what? Come on, come on. What? What? Okay, all right. What happened? Yo, what happened?
Yo, what happened? Look, I, I don't know. All I know is they called me and said that if I was Mexican to Jermaine, your guess is as good as mine. Yes, that's me. Right this way. Skeeter! insurance to speak of, and no next of kin, the county is required by law to cremate the body in such circumstances. So there's like nothing that you guys can do for us? Without cash on hand, I'm afraid not. However, you do have 24 hours to come up with the money before the county moves on with cremation. 24 hours? That's not nearly enough time to do anything. I'm sorry, sir. All I can do is give you the information. Everybody in here trash. What's up, homeboy? Turn it. Bro, you ain't said nothing. You just gonna get shot and die? Hey, y'all hold on real fast on here. Hello? What's up, girl? This is what I was, this is what I was talking about whenever you come. What's wrong? Hello? Yo, what's up, man? Am I busy right now? No, 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 I got time to talk. How you come out of the parachute? Oh, okay, hold on. And how you? Okay, never mind. You said you got some news. What she look? What she look like? You got bad news. What she look like then? Okay, well look, 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 look. Check this out. Check this out. I'm in the middle of. Uh, I'm finna get dressed. Just, hey, just pull up on me. Just pull up on me, man. Fight that shit, cuz. What? You gotta fight it, cuz. Them Looney Tunes, they not real, cuz. You been drinking tonight? Nah, cuz. That's them Looney Tunes. Come on, I gotta get you to the emergency room, get that dope out your system. Let's ride. Cuz, I said I'm okay. Cuz, let's ride. I, they I'm repo my car, I drive I yours. I said I'm okay. Cuz, let's go, cuz. You damn strong, man. I don't trust you, bro. I want to see for myself. Why? I want to see for myself. No. Come on, bro. Take me. Or no. I'll walk. I'll walk. Did I get... Baylor, listen, man. You got me off track. I'm trying to tell you something that's very important. What can be more important than LaRoyal and Skeeter together? Come on, bro. Where? Oh. Yesterday I got a call. Yesterday I 
I got a call, man, and I, I didn't know what to do, and Dayla, by the time we made it to the hospital... Let's get your hands off me, bro. I understand, because there wasn't nothing they can do. By the time we made it to the hospital, there wasn't... There wasn't anything nobody could do. Dayla! I'm good, cuz. Dalen! I said I'm good! almost 9 30. I got a few things lined up. Our first stop is a Sherwood Bank about a loan. A loan? For what? My brother didn't have no insurance. No insurance, no cash. No cash means we got about a day before they cremate. Exactly. Next we got a 130 trap new big rip. What? It's just in case. Just in case what? Sherwood tripping. Look, if they come through we don't need big rip. If that's the case, you can just cancel. Fool, if you cancel, then we might as well make our own funeral arrangements because we can't do that to Big Rick. Look, bro, bro was the one that helped Big Rick go legit. All we gotta do is remind him of that. Oh, okay, so that's what we doing. We just gonna remind the neighborhood dope boy we got a debt to pay. Former dope boy. He can't be that stupid. I don't know what y'all. I'm about to eat me something. What did I do? Crane. Crane. Sugar. Move, stupid. your time I just wanted to touch bases with you because this Thursday we're actually hosting a financial literacy seminar our guest speaker is industry leader Savion Dexter hey hey kill it with all that literacy talk bro I've been know how to read all right he's talking about financial literacy not illiteracy dummy hey hey chill out chill out look at this okay here's the thing this is where I think a lot of loan officers go wrong I don't know you, you don't know me, but I do know this. You are all prospective borrowers, customers, oh. and I'm the top loan officer in the area. If I can't get you the loan you need, you don't really need it. Listen, I think good people need to know good people, so I won't waste your time. If you don't want to attend the event, that's okay, but what I'd like to do is schedule a 15-minute appointment with you. Thanks. That's exactly why we're here today. Uh, Royal actually scheduled an 11 o'clock appointment with you so we could talk about a loan. Right, Ruben. Dante. Dante, that's what I said. You just said Ruben, bro. Stop playing. Ruben is Swahili for Dante. Read much? Brother, stay woke. One more game. One more game. I'm a fucking brace, baby boy. Look, 
I done already ran your credit score on Credit Karma. It ain't gonna happen. You barely scraping on 600, you heard me. I, I mean, on 600 ain't that bad. I mean, it ain't awesome, but it ain't bad. Uh, three of y'all. All three of us together? Yo, Sko shot. Yo, debt to income ratio is lopsided as a bad afro. Baby girl ain't got enough establishing credit. What that mean? It mean, even though you ain't got no debt, you also don't have any history of financing purchases. So no record of your spending and repayment habits. Look here, I'm trying to figure out your goals. And if you'll work with me, I can try and help y'all improve your status. You heard me? No. I'm busy. I'm out. Look, I totally understand. I'm very busy myself. So what I'm gonna do is send you an email with availability and you let me know what works best for you. Have a nice day. Are you looking for an unforgettable travel experience? Travel agents that are focused on combining your passions with luxurious travel destinations? Here at Travenue, we are members of the largest and most well-respected travel brand on the globe, and we take pride in being able to offer our customers access to over 100 travel destinations around the world. Our mission is to make all your travel arrangements seamless and effortless. You can expect superior customer service, discounted rates, luxury hotels, and even private jets. And to top it all off, we'll throw in exclusive in-house concierge service. Travenue, we are the only road to true vacation bliss. Hello. Welcome to Travenue, the road trip to your perfect travel destination. I'm Venetia. How may I help y'all? Oh uh, yes, um, I'm Dante Clemens. This is uh, Skylar Devereaux. Um, we call it Skeeter for obvious reasons. And this is... Um, my name is Arroyo Gwendell Law at your service. <laughs> Oh I'm sorry, what were you saying? Uh, yeah, um, we're here to see Big Rick. What y'all want with Big Rick? Hey, what y'all whispering about over there? Um, we was, uh, we was wondering about your name tag. What about it? Um, did you uh did you pick with the wrong name tag, bro? It's my name tag. Oh. Oh, uh huh. So your name is uh Kenyatta? Is that a problem? <coughs> no, no, no. Uh, yeah, it's a girl's name. It's a unisex name. It's a unisex name. Casey is a unisex name. Alex is a unisex name. My name is Skyler. That's a unisex name. Former Prime Minister of Kenya, Yamo Kenyatta. That's his surname, stupid. Uh, what? Nothing. The point is, it's a girl's name. Come on, Steve. Listen, listen. Man, look. If the man says his name a unisex name, then it probably is a unisex name. Besides, yeah. I'm pretty sure your middle name is pretty extremely masculine, right? Uh, actually, I, I don't like to tell people my... Man, name. look. Man, man up, all right? Man up. Stop bumping your guns right and telling your name, man. Yeah. Come on. Yeah, come on. Yeah, yeah, okay. All right. You want to know my middle name? What? You want to know my middle name? Please don't. My middle name is Keisha. <laughs> Keisha? <laughs> They want to see your cake. It don't matter. <laughs> Mr. Keller, why are you harassing my customer? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. You mean to tell me your mama named you KKK? 
Only in America. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you stepping from the jungle. Oh, okay. All right, we just got Trump out of the office, and now we gotta deal with this. Pick, pick me, Skeeter. How, how you grow up like that? <laughs> Kiki. Oh, so that's funny to you. Boy, if you don't get your big, swole, sensitive self out of my face, somebody come get this boy. Because I be doggone if I get my butt with my dude named Kiki. What? 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 Kiki, do you what? love me? Are you riding? Kiki. <laughs> Keisha! Hey, girl! What's up? Why don't you take the rest of the day off? Because I don't want to. I wasn't asking. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I'll take the day off. And you'll clock in tomorrow at uh the same time I always clock in at. What you say? Uh, uh, 7 a.m. 7 a.m. It is. Wait. I got to do that excursion thing in the morning. I'm sorry. I understand that you all have an urgent matter to discuss with me. I mean, <laughs> if it's not too much trouble, I know you're a very industrious individual and we dare not to bother you with our predicaments. I'm never too busy for Skylar Devereaux. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Dante LaRoyo, follow me. So what? We the help now? This is mine. You she got your own thing. You know? Thank you. Thank you. You know, I had to go to jail. Yeah. After you know, doing what I do for some many years. That's what's up. Just trying to go. Yes, sir, sir. Yes, sir. If you need me to help with anything, I mean, anything, I got you. Anything. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Look, I'm sorry, but can we speed this up a little bit? Some of us have places to be and things to do. Boy, shut up. Your mama ain't gonna die if you a few minutes late with her raspberry pop rocks to her purple urkel. First of all, they're blackberry pop rocks, and don't be worried about them getting my mama. Hey, <laughs> chill out, man. It's obviously they ain't talked in a while. Talk. Oh. You heard the man, Pee Wee. Why don't you go cool down in the lobby? I'll have my assistant come bring you some ice cream and cookies or something. Go on now, let the grown folks in first. I want some ice cream and cookies too. You can have whatever you like. <laughs> That's what's up. Okay. Our mission is always testing you. Everybody testing you today. Come on, little boy. You ain't about that life no more. You ain't about that. You ain't got to do that to him. And a dragon. But ain't got no ice cream here. Bruh. Man, who we calling Pee Wee? Wait a minute. Can we get back to business? Yes, business. Uh, whose business? Barbara's business. Wait, mm. Jermaine got a business now? Oh, okay, okay. What business is he into? You know we gotta support one another. No, what Dante meant about Jermaine's business, he really means getting his affairs in order. Are you trying to tell me Jermaine's dead? Yeah, he passed away last night. Damn. Look, whatever y'all need from me, just tell me. Spare no expense. Whatever you need, you got it. After Friday. No, 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 no. We need... At least by Thursday. If we don't have it, he's, they're going to cremate the body. I'm sorry. Y'all know I'm down. I got y'all back, but Jermaine was like family to me. But my accounts are still frozen until Saturday. If y'all need anything up until then, hey, it's yours. I'm sorry. Hey, 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 hey. What about us? You catching up? Bye bye. Line ass. Bye. Hey, y'all.
Y'all go ahead. Uh, look like somebody called me. I think it's Pastor. Hello? Oh, hey, Pastor. Hey, how you doing? Uh-huh. Yeah, um, I'm doing all right. How about yourself? Yes, sir. Yes, Pastor. Yes, Pastor. Uh huh. Yes. Uh, Skeeter, she all right. You. Yes. Yes, Pastor. something to Jesus. Can we come back another time? I really don't like being here. You're supposed to give 10% yes. or whatever you get. Look, I didn't want to be here any more than y'all did, but I told Pastor that we would stop by. Is there any particular reason why we're here so early? What do you mean early? We're 15 minutes late. Exactly. She was ain't started passing around the offering plate yet. So we early. Love's a cheerful giver. You should be happy when it's time to give. Because God don't never shortchange you. Whenever you got a need, he needs you. Can I get an amen on that? Amen. So you're supposed to be a cheerful giver. This time, you're supposed to run up and give your collection. I always look forward to giving back to Almighty God. It is time for collection sake. Can I get an amen? Can I get an amen? We like the coin. We like the kind of jingle, but we prefer the kind of folds, if you know what I mean. Can I get an amen? Sister Devereaux, Brother Lowe, and Brother Clemens, it's so good to see you all again. I really appreciate y'all coming out and visit with me. <laughs> yes, 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 good. <laughs> hey, baby, you remember this bunch? I used to call them the get along gang because when they get together, they fight like cats and dogs. But God help if you try to separate them from one another. They just sit there the rest of the service and look like somebody didn't just mutilated their dog. <laughs> oh yes, how could I ever forget your precious little get along gang? Their hieroglyphics on the back of our church van was evidence of their many church escapades. They must have cost our church hundreds of dollars over the span of a decade. First lady. What? We couldn't find a decent fan until they stopped coming. Now you done gone and invited them back? Are you out of your mind? These are our guests. They are none of my guests. They are your guests. They are backsliding former members, wayward Christians. Jeez. At least she called us Christians. What she implied? Take the win, Scott. We are for Jermaine, and that's it. Let it go. Still just as disrespectful as she can be. She's just reciprocating the example that you have showed her. Excuse you? You heard what I said. And you ain't never got to excuse me because when I let it go, everybody in this room gonna excuse themselves. <laughs> I can't believe you sitting here defending them. 
I can't believe you have the gall to sit here and continue to persecute them like some common cockroaches in the trash. You're the reason why they left in the first place. She's just reciprocating that same nasty venom vow that you've shown in her direction for the past 10 years. When did you ever say anything nice? Why you never showed her any compassion? When her mother died, where were you? You didn't even bother to check up on her. In fact, since they've been gone, did you check up on any of them? I am your wife and the first lady of this church. You will not disrespect me in this manner. I don't know what in the hell done possessed you this morning, but you better hurry up and cast it out in the name of Jesus because I'm still your husband. And unless you are a wayward Christian yourself, I suggest you better check your little attitude. I am the pastor of this church. And I think it's about time that you excuse yourself from the pastor's study. Honey, I apologize. I, I apologize for my rude demeanor. Maybe it was a bit harsh. Maybe I was just being too vague. Get out! Have a seat, Brother Clinton. Yes, sir. Uh, Pastor, we appreciate what you did for us, but um, don't you think that was a little bit much? Sky, just because I'm saved doesn't mean that I got to be spineless. Let us pray. <clears throat> oh, most merciful God, we ask that you come before us this morning. And first of all, that you place your hand on the First Lady for her abhorrent behavior in front of my extinguished guests. We ask that you bless her. We ask that you touch her, that you touch her heart, oh God. We ask that you bless these young people that have come here today to meet with me that you guide them. We ask all of this in the name of your loving son, Jesus. Amen. Mm -hmm. Amen. Okay. Well, I got some good news and I got some bad news. Okay. Bad news first. Okay, bad news. <clears throat> the church will not be able to cover the burial costs and the funeral costs. Brother Germain was not a member of St. Katrina Exegetical Baptist Church, and thus, because of the bylaws, we can't do that. What you mean he wasn't a member of the church? We met him at the church. During Bible study. Mm -hmm. What? Yeah, I, he, he never came here regularly, only during Bible study. This man came to Bible study at your church for almost 15 years. And just because he didn't want his name on the roster, you, you're just going to deny him any help? Sky, I'm not trying to deny him anything. I want to help. But as a pastor, I just have a single vote. It has to go with the majority of the church. Wait a minute, Pastor. You know Jermaine didn't have no insurance. You asked us to come down into the church because you said you could help us. Yes, we can. But you won't. No, Scott, wait. Scott, wait. Hold up. Come on. The good news. Now, if God is able to provide you to cover the cost of the funeral and the mortuary service, I will waive my eulogy fee, and the church will waive their fee for use of the sanctuary. I know it's not totally up to you, Pastor, but I'm, I'm just disappointed, that's all. offer still stands. If the church is able to do more, I'll let you know. Come on, let's pray. Gracious God, loving, loving, loving Father, we thank you for waking us up this morning. We want to thank you, oh Father, for these beautiful young people who come before us. You know their needs, oh most merciful God. Help them move to be the kind of servants that you want us all to be, oh God. 
We thank you in the name of your loving son, Jesus, who died for all of us. Jews things for everybody. Why we can't do something for him, man? Hey, calm down, man. How? How can I calm down, man? We supposed to have the faith to move mountains. But get, we moving molehills, man. Don't that make you feel some type of way? You think I ain't angry? How can you be angry? I planned this whole day for bruh, bruh. What did you do, man? I've been here, okay? Every, every step of the way, you ain't been here, man. Who you think playing these steps out? That was me while you were sitting on the couch. Just calm down. Just calm down. It's not about you. And it's damn well sure not about you. Now you gotta remember who we doing this for. Remember who we doing this for. Joke aside, though. If I ever decide to close my eyes, if, you go to if, sleep. no, if I die, like if, if I just, no, 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 real talk, real talk, real Look, talk. I'm, I'm about to go real talk. Me. No, listen, listen, listen. Alex. If I ever decide to close these eyes, I'm gonna tell y'all like this here. I want everybody who I didn't ever gave a ride to the, the grocery store. If I gave any, especially y'all who I gave money to. I want y'all to celebrate my life right here. And what I want y'all to do, when y'all get everybody out here, I need y'all to just take my ashes and just spread them right here. Yeah, I want y'all to celebrate my life right here. And what I want y'all to do, when y'all get everybody out here, I need y'all to just take my ashes and just spread them right here. So I can just chill with my people forever. You understand what I'm saying? No, he don't. <laughs> Shut up. what I'm talking about. Told you, baby. When life gives you lemons, baby, you're gonna... Like a fever. No, no, that's what I'm telling you. Brand on Android, boy. You know we on the iPhone, boy. What I'm telling you is lemons, baby. You gotta suck that up, man. Quit acting like a little punk all the time, man, and toughen up, bro. I'm glad you're doing better. What? I don't think you should do that. Don't do that no more. Don't do what no more? <laughs> baby, you gotta learn how to eat. That's what like you gotta give what life give you, baby. You gotta eat it all up. Just like La Royale with your mama famous turtle cheesecake, baby. Lemons, baby. You know what to do with it. Bro, I'm not trying to argue you about semantics. I'm trying to create a scenario for you. That's your problem. That's your problem, bro. Man up. Quit being a little punk all your life. You know what I mean? What? What? Rob wanted to be cremated, okay? He wanted to be cremated? Yes. And that's why I've been trying to tell you that you can not. I'm just trying to tell you what, bro. Bro, what you not? One thing you're not going to do. 
It's just go at my scenarios right there. That's life, baby. You got to take it and suck it up. So what's up? What's the problem then if you want to be creepy? Bro, we'll pull, pull down on me, bro. I got I got the yeah. <laughs> I got the yeah. Big bottle. We can share because I didn't have that much money. So, you know, we, you know. I'm saying go half on me then. No, no, you got a problem. Go half on me, bro. Go half with me. Bro, you know I ain't drunk since Jermaine passed away, bro. That's what he want, baby. He want us to get towed up. Are you It's for the little ash to, to put Jermaine in. Hey, man, it's only $400. The only thing that's going to pay for it is the urn. Whatever you thinking that it costs, add about 2000 more on to that, okay? If I can offer you 100 more, bro, that's it. But if y'all not going to use it, you can easily give me my money back with y'all ungrateful ass. He <laughs> ain't ungrateful. At least we know who to come to. No, I figured you was going to say that. Don't come to me for nothing. And I want my money back. You gonna pay me my money back. Or, 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 hook me up with Skeeter. Just pay me my money back then. Look, you gave it because of Jermaine, so this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna use it. Go on, find some way to use it. There's some type of cheesy movie in there where everything fade to black. Give me back my money. Pick the mama out first, man. Then come holler at your uncle. I just, I just met her today. I was gonna let you know about it. You gotta give me a little time. Man, all right, all right. Man, you gotta be wet here. I'ma holla at you, nephew. All right. This was tough. Yeah. Yeah, how y'all doing? Where's the mud? Who I follow your nose? It always knows what tastes delicious and what tastes gross. So what y'all wrapping parakeet or something now? Two pan. What? You know the breakfast cereal bird. Hey now, hey, look. What's up, baby? What's up, baby? How you doing, baby? I'm doing real good. That actually is uh, one of our rarest uh, items. Uh, we charging thirty for that. Oh yes, ma'am. Uh, yes, ma'am. That's uh, actually forty. But let me see. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. i and your mama ain't too old to hatch some eggs, baby boy. I understand. So, okay, well then back up, chicken little. Come on now, don't make me swear you up. And do what? Come on, well, well I'm, I'm right here. What's up? I'm not gonna do this in front of my mama. Well, well, well. It ain't Pam and Gina. What you two bloated chickens over here cackling about? Bloated? I know you ain't calling nobody bloated. Over there looking like a pregnant Kool-Aid man. <laughs> I'm gonna respect my elders right now and sell this chain. Man, you better go ahead for I fart on you, boy. <laughs> I'm sorry, Skeeter, baby. Please forgive me. Don't do me, baby. You know I ain't the one. <laughs> bloated Kool-Aid, look at it. <laughs> You over here talking about bacon and eggs. I need you to focus on them sweet breads. Sweet breads? What kind? Y'all got cake or corn? Shoot, I like both of them. I think what he means to say is beef or lamb. Just because they call it meatloaf doesn't mean it's actually bread. Furthermore, why are you putting sugar in meatloaf? It's supposed to be savory. 
Let's send a delicious tomato base. Then it's supposed to be smooth and tangy. Sweetbread is a culinary name, typically for a thymus or a pancreas, typically from a calf or lamb. Oh, okay. Um, Help! These cows can't serve you! Come on, Skeeter, baby. I said I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Don't make me hurt you like that, Daylin. You know I don't like to talk to you like that. Come on, baby. You know I just be trying to get you riled up. You know why? Why? So you gonna sit and act like you ain't got it? Got what, Daylin? Oh, that mercy. Yo. So like I was saying, you look like you got some Puerto Rican. Hey, listen up. What in the bowl of bologna? What do you think you finna do to my grandma? Look here, man. I understand your need to flex your masculinity in front of your mama and your even finer grandmama over there. <laughs> but, um... She got it. She got it. Hey! I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Hey! Come on, baby. We finna play some cards today. Help! I'm next! They gonna eat me! Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, you ain't ready. 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 <laughs> Get off me, Hannibal Lecter! Yeah, that's right. You better enjoy that taste. It's the last one you ever gonna have. You really touched in the head, aren't you? You did hear me say beef or lamb, right? Yeah, I heard you say something. I heard you say, like, thyroid glam, wrapped in pancetta with glabella stew. What? Now why the hell would we make stew out of eyebrows? Well, actually, the glabella isn't the eyebrows at all. It's actually the meat between the eyebrows. In fact, if you pinch hard enough, you're able to tell whether or not a person is dehydrated. But just grab a piece for yourself, gently but firmly. Will firmly you shut up? up? Y'all serving beef or lamb? Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Uh, if you keep rolling up on me, I'm gonna fall on you. And I'm gonna turn you into a chocolate chip. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Man, what you think gonna happen to my grandma when you get on her? Yeah. Yeah, you probably right. <laughs> See? Organs? Yes, but hear me out. You done scarf down them chitlins every time I cook it for you and your mom and them. Yeah, but... But nothing. And who be scarfing down them chicken gizzards every Easter? <laughs> Wait, hold on, Skeeter. Hold on. Oh, I don't need to hold on, but you do. And you better get a firm grip, because I'm about to bust you straight out them spandex. <laughs> <laughs> that ain't gonna take much. Four ounces of water, I'm gonna cut off her circulation. <laughs> Hell, give her one Eminem, man. Pow, she gonna be out here booty butt naked. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Bring your ass. Both of you. My pleasure, bitch. And I hope you charge that thing up so you don't break down halfway down the pavilion. Over there looks like a blue alpine. Yeah. yeah. Man, you make them so crispy and flaky. Come to think of it. I want you the one throw mountain oysters. Tell this dummy told you what they were. <laughs> Don't you say we won't ever speak about it ever again. Tell your mom. That's okay, I got some for you, yo. But what? And I got some for you too with them ashy pole polishing oh. lips. Oh, you got some problems? Yeah. Back it up, Terry! With your old handicap ass. Don't play with me. Come on. Come on, Barry. Show what you gonna do. I got a man though, huh? Yeah. Y'all don't know now. <laughs> so what's her name? She she sold already. Thirty dollars. So what she a hooker now? Thirty dollars, man. Now, you ain't gotta pay no thirty dollars. We just agreed on. So yeah. when do I get my cut? That was your cut. Girl, don't make me get out this chair. What? Oh, you won't go. Watch me. Watch me. I can stop and roll it. Yeah, what? Come on. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Whatever. Yeah, me too. Me too. And how you gonna do that? What? You gonna stop, drop, and roll? You can't walk, helpful? A rubber tub, your ass gonna roll down the whole goddamn hill. How you gonna do that, helpful? What you gonna stop, drop, and roll? You can't walk? What you gonna do? Well, anyway, what? 
My bad, young buck. Stop touching me, man. Well, I gotta touch somebody. You want me to let me touch your mama? You s uh, yeah, yeah. This is the line? Yeah. And you about to cross it. Oh, okay, my bad. One hand, Dale. One hand. Are you scared? Does twenty dollars a book sound scared to you? I got places to be. <laughs> twenty dollars a book is nice, but uh a hundred dollars is more my speed. And uh you might as well take them pennies to the slot machine because uh over here baby is a grown folks table. Now what you gonna do? A six hundred and fifty dollar buy in. What you gonna do, Shalana? We're in. Have you lost your mind? I said we're in. Deal. No deal. Now normally, first hand will be open. But we ain't playing for one hand. So be ready to make your bid after you pick up your last card. I might have one book. One book? That's what I said, ain't it? Now, I thought I told your fat butt that this was a bad idea. You ain't complaining about my fat butt last night. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he was complaining. It was just mama you couldn't understand. <laughs> <laughs> Dale, hmm? how many you got? I got six. You know you got six? Oh, I know I got six. <laughs> All right, come on, baby, get the broom. Whoa, how y'all gonna sweep us when we got bored? First of all, I wasn't talking to you. Secondly, I don't know how you fit that whole orange down your throat. And you know what? I don't even want to know. <laughs> now, check this. There's a sister online that goes by the name Professor. Terrence <laughs> Yeah. So, uh, like I was saying, yeah, two for ten, yeah. you know. I mean, I could hook you up. Say what? I uh, know she said I said two for ten. Two for ten? No, it's one for ten, man. What you doing? You can, excuse me, mama. Uh, you can either do, you can deal with my mama or you can let me do with your mama, yeah. That's right. What, but hey, you taking all in it? Well, hey, what's man, up? Man, I'm not going to take this, man. But... Yeah. Walk it off. I already got a book over here. Shit. It's mine. I touched it first. It's mine. Plus, I'm, I'm the one that's getting the book. What you want it so bad for? Because I want to learn. Oh, you need somebody to practice something? <laughs> Boy, please. I need a study party, and I know Crash Dummy. <laughs> Come on now, play the game. My and don't be reneging either. It's your turn. It's your lady, her last two. She, he reneged. He, he put out a turn. He ain't Automatic <laughs> book. Next. It was this yours is mine. Anyway. Y'all yeah, making this feel that. easy, baby. Uh, yeah, Run me my okay. money. Run me my goddamn money. Put you the money the, on the you table. You want the book? It's your girl. She, she don't want to put the money on the table. You the one that reneged. It was going to happen regardless. Boy, bye. You got that too. I thought you said six Talk your shit, Dale. Talk it. Walk it like I talk it. Come on now. Y'all ass ain't even going bored. You ain't even got you ain't got nothing. I don't see nothing on the table. What? Yeah, It's on you. Alright, I got down for a minute. Go ahead. What you do? Still ain't got it. It's him. <laughs> He's <laughs> with a vengeance. You got it? What you mm -hmm. got, partner? Oh, y'all got one book. Oh, one book. I'm proud of you. You can have that one book. We'll take it if you yes. give it to Go you. ahead, baby. I still got my one. We'll take it if you give it to me. And one. Hold up, though. Bam. What you got? 